Welcome to a video exploring what I call the Super Index, a typewritten manuscript of 600 or so pages spelled in more or less contemporary Czech, but covering about 200 years of records. It's book number 15489. Let's take a look at what it looks like. It has, as I said, typewritten entries. These were created in 1944. I can imagine the purpose, perhaps, but be that as it may, we have benefited from it. It takes one of uh, 11 books, and it lists the items alphabetically and with the page number in the book. Now, it is numbered one page for each pair, which makes it very easy to narrow down where it's at. PV means post view, means on the back side of that page number, as opposed to left and right as we are probably used to it. The one thing that's a little bit of a problem is that these are not in chronological order. For instance, the first few uh, pages are marriages from 1725, but then, over here, we get births from 1656. If you find that you have ancestors in this area, I recommend that you come up with a spreadsheet like this. You can um, email me and ask me to send my template to you, where I've already listed things like this. The first book about births, it kind of stands by itself. It's not a continuous year, whereas the others are quite nicely chronological. But for instance, the first marriage group is the tenth paper clip on the other screen. We're going to be looking at Travnicek, and we are going to find two things, how to translate the index entry into the actual book page, and then we're going to find a little surprise. We're going to find out that the spelling for Travnicek changed, and we would not have a clue that this had happened unless somebody had put this index together. Okay, we're going to look at a marriage on image 95 of the index. Let's go over to 95. And we will see some marriages that don't really play into what we're researching here, but we'll learn how to use the book. This is the name. This is the person getting married. This is the father, or in the case of, of Nemanjowski, the mother. So Jehoj has two children in here, Paula Zinia and Tomasz. And they are from the village Zidanice, which happens to be the one that ties into the research that someone is doing. We'll take a look at 317 first for Polizinia. And it was book 15413. If we go back and look at my Excel, we see that. Okay. This is going to be one of the styles of record that's text type rather than column type. I think I got that wrong. Hmm. Let's go look. Correct myself. That's an earlier one. Paula Zinia, okay, it needs to be on 317. So see, we're one off because of the cover probably. So I need to be one page over. Paula Zinia was not, where did you go, young lady? There she is. She is not post view, so I don't expect to find her on the back page, back of the page. And in fact, she is the last one on here. It is easier to figure these out by eliminating the 
um, entries based on the city. Oh, it's still 316. The other one was 315. All righty. I didn't see her and I knew something was wrong. So she was from Zidane, it says so. Zlatkov, Divishov, something else. This one, this one. None of these match it because it was the bride's village and there's the name right there. So Paula Zinia, T R A Travnichka. You know, that would be very difficult to read if you're a beginner. But at least when it's pointed out to you, then you can uh, figure it out. So none of these marriages apparently play into the line I was researching. So let's go back and take a look at births, though. Births would be on 72. And we are going to see a nice sequence of them down here. And we see from the village of Zhdanitse, uh, Zhdanitse, Christian is the uh, father, Gabriel Yuzhi Karel. And so the order of births would be Yuzhi Karel Gabriel. And I looked at all three of these, and they do have the same father and mother. And so we will just go take a look at Yerji. He is on page 62, the back side of it. Now remember, we were two off. So that would be 64. And then it's on the back, so it must be on 65. Whoops. And just to show you in the Excel, for the births, it is still the same 15413 book number. And we said it was on the back of 62. So, oops, somewhere along the line we lost a page. Happens, there was a blank page, something. So it's on the back of 62. Yes, there we go. And it was Yirji, which if you translate to Latin, German, it's George, Georg. Which one of the two is it? There it is. Travnicek, Matka, Dorota. All three of those match this. But when I looked at one of the other ones, something kind of hit me. There's this extra word in there, C-Z-A-P. And I wondered, I wonder what vel means. I still have to look that up. It probably means or, or also known as. And um, so I said, I wonder what happens if I go look at C. in them. It's on 43. And I was more surprised than I thought I would be. Because look at this. It says C. Toravnicek. Then even more to my surprise, there were other children listed. Now, going back to the first three, we had Yirji, Karel, and Gabriel. So here's Yirji and Gabriel, but no Karel. So we lost Karel somehow. And what I missed the first time through
which was on 72, was that it also said to C chop. With these then, the earliest one would be Jan. He's on the back of page seven. Were there two marriages? Okay, that's page six, so we've got to go over one more to get to seven. And then to get to the back of seven, notice how five is crossed out. I need to go one more to get to the back of seven. This particular one is three from the bottom. There was the name of the village. So it was from this village instead. There's Chop, Christian, Chop, Matka, Dorota. It's the same couple. The chances that you would have a couple with the name of Christian and Dorota in the same area, in the same time frame, having children that fit is just highly unlikely that it would be a unique, two unique couples. So looking back at the index, we were missing Karel, but now we have um, in order, they would be Jan, Marjina, Yirji, the missing Karel. And there had been a really big gap in between Karel and Gabriel. And sure enough, we've got a Tomas in there. And yes, he is Christian and Dorota. We have an Antonin in there. And then finally we get to Gabriel. Gabriel. Then that um, is a better sequence. So I don't know why the name changed from Chup to Travnicek, but we have eight kids. Are we done? No, we're not. Come back for part two of this three-part series. Bye.